Hello everybody and welcome back to the SB Game Fun channel and to another episode of The Sinking City. Here we are in depressing Oakmont. The brown derby behind us and uh, what is that? Some strange structure. I keep seeing on my runs. Anyhow, we'll eventually get to it. Anyhow, um, we last left off. Let's see. We're supposed to go Usha. Whenever the substance may be, it is supposed to prevent the undead from healing. Armed with this, I'd like to sh I have a shot at dealing with Usha. Okay, I hope I know what I'm doing when I make bullets, right? Make, can I make bullets? Is that what they said? You can make bullets? Oh, I can. I can craft. No, I don't. I don't I, I'm already maxed. Okay, so we need to go. Uh, we need to go. This is a cemetery, right? Yeah, I think we need to go to the cemetery. Let's take a look at the... Here it is. Usha hides underwater in her tomb. The entrance is in the cemetery, marked with five finger-shaped stones. That is exactly what Joseph Hill asked me to find out. This is exactly. Okay, so. Entrance is in the cemetery. So, I need to go here. So, let's... um. Let's go to Reed Heights and go from there. Okay, here we are. And right behind us, take the boat to the cemetery. Look for five finger tombstone, right? Five finger shaped stones. Five finger shaped stones. There it is. Oh my gosh. Okay, something tells me I'm going to be dealing with some wild beast. Oh, look at that. Five fingers. Is it in this building? Oh my gosh. Jeez, scared the n crap out of me. Okay, I guess I'm. I guess I'm going. I guess I'm going in. Oh my gosh. Charles. We're going to die. It's been a while since I dived. So hopefully... Okay. I can't use anything. Oh, missiles. What is this? Okay, that's an actual bullet. What is this? It's a flare. Okay, it looks like we got light, so I'm gonna go to the bullets. And then if I need to repair, I use the E to repair.
Man, I hope I don't run into any creatures down here. Knowing my luck. I'm going to die. Just follow the lights. Follow the lights. Oh, no. It's Cthulhu and Katiganar and the... Oh, jeez. Look at that. It's a massive creature. Oh. What the heck? What was that? I can't even pick that up. I want to see what... Gotta repair my, my brain is fried. Can I make it through here though? Okay, repair, repair, repair. Oh no, I'm dead. <laughs> Am I going in the right direction? I don't know. We'll find out. I'm going to try it again. Because the lights lead in that direction. I was just careless with how I... I was careless with how I... I went in there. Repair. Repair. Standing too close to those vents. That's what I need to do is avoid the vents. Avoid it when they're venting. I gotta watch my brain too because it's flatlined. Charles Reed freaked out. Okay, let's come over here. Stop. Those things. Oh my gosh, I'm losing my brain. Repair, repair. Oh, my mind is coming back. Gotta get past that big giant creature right there. It was killing me. Okay, so we need to go up. Let's make sure we have our bullets on us. I don't like my come up against some creature. Oh. Is it here? Oh, yes, it is. Something feels wrong with this statue. There's no trace of seaweed on it. Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. What is that? It's a smiley face. Okay. Oh, there it is. Hope there's no monsters waiting for me in the water. Oh. Run! 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 Oh, goodness. Even the ugliest monsters have vulnerable spots. Yep. Okay. There's Usha. There's no safe point here, man. I got a fighter. I guess I'm... 
Oh, goodness. All right, there's nothing, nothing left to do but to take her on. You, she forbids you to go further. The sorcerer still lives. I came to put an end to you, undead abomination. Then you will suffer. This will be your doom now. Oh. Oh, man. is that she's around yourself oh crap oh my gosh I kill this this chick. Oh. All evidence collected. Okay. So the key evidence has not been collected yet. I saw a box here. Ah, I got a 12 gauge. Reload, reload. Health. So, hey, where did, where did her body go? Rudd. Hmm. So we shot that guy. I guess maybe that was her healing spot. Prevented her from healing. And then when I think I assume we killed her. Is there nothing else here? I think that might be it. That was our objective. Come down here and tangle with the crazy Usha. There, I don't see anything else except for the two box. So let's take a look at our case files. It updated. There will be no more talking. I have to kill Usha and she'll make this sunken place my grave or she'll make my make this sunken place my grave too. I killed Usha thanks to Joseph Hill's ointment. Now I've got her ashes. I should return to him to get the information I need so dearly. It's time for answers. Okay, so we did finish. So there's nothing else here to collect. Okay, okay, stop pressing E. <laughs> stop pressing E. What a strange way to rise up. It's like you get the bends, man. All the blood vessels pop in your brain and you die. Horrible death. Whoa! He's already here. Okay. Am I... Do I have enough? I want to take this guy out too because he is... In my opinion...
opinion, he's not the best character either. Okay, I'm I'm maxed out. Okay. Now I believe this guy can also conjure up wild beasts, so I better be prepared. He's oh can't go back down either. Alright, let's talk to this guy. I found Usha. She won't bother anyone again. That's that's great news. Did you gather her remains? The, the ashes? I did. We need to talk, Joseph. You promised you'd tell me how to reach Katiganor. I remember. Don't worry. I'll need some time to gather everything. Let's meet in my lab. Are you going to revive her again? This time, it won't be as difficult. In just a short while, we'll have the answer. We can steer mankind away from catastrophe. Oh man, he's gonna try to re resurrect her again? I don't like this guy, man. Can I kill him? No, I still gotta meet in his in his apartment building. We gotta figure out what that is. What it the path to Katiganar. Alright, so let's get to the boat. I don't wanna spend more time in the graveyard than I need to. I hate graveyards. Uh, especially hate it if he looks like this. This is a horrible. Oh, jeez. Okay. Why did I go that way? Bob up. Yeah, it's just like a. Disney ride. Alright, let's get to the uh, fast travel booth and blow this taco stand. I wonder how close we are to completing the game. Alright, so let's go here and we'll make our way back up to Joseph Hill's residence. Whoops. Hold on here. I gave, jo I gave Joseph Hill the ashes that were all that remained of Usha. He will prepare everything needed in his lab on Moreland Road between Seasmith and Powder House in Northern Salvation Harbor. Then, when he finally gets the information from Usha, I will know how to get into Katiganar and stop the madness. Oh man. Molin between Seasmith Avenue and Powder. Is that, is that, hold on. Is that that one right there? No, it is not. Salvation Harbor. Nope. Okay, it's a different spot. I got, I gotta map it. His lab is in Northern Salvation Harbor, so that's up. So that's up here. Oh no, that's Reed Heights. Sorry. North. Is that it? Hidden lab. There it is. So I don't need to go anywhere. I need to go here and take a boat trip out to here. That's the closest one. Let's let's go here. Okay. No, that's right here. I need to go here. I'll get it right, folks. All right, so from here we need to, to head south, take a boat west to there. So we're going to... Oh, come on. Stop hitting people, Charles. Your vote is your choice. Your choice. Remember that, folks. That's what he said. Your vote is your choice. Choose wisely. 
But you can't complain if you don't vote. Don't get lost in your depression, man. This place can turn you sour very quickly. Close are we? Oh, we're almost there. It's near here somewhere. Oh, is it? Yes. There it is. Charles, I hope you're ready to survive. Okay, can't, <laughs> E, press E, no, don't do that. Okay. You got what we needed from her? Yes, yes, it all went better than expected. She revealed a lot, though, not all of it I wanted to hear. What lies beneath the city? Or how do I get, okay, how do I enter Katiganar? That's the question, but let's ask her, let's ask him what lies beneath the city. What did she say about the ruins under Oakmont? It was some sort of temple or prison. I do not think she knows. She was just one member of the cult that worshipped the monoliths. Is that all? I'm underwhelmed. How do I get into Katiganar? And did you answer our most pressing question, how to get into Katiganar? Yes. Usha said you must find something called a cave finger on each of three monoliths. The first is in the city center, with two elsewhere. I take that once you've found the three cave fingers, you can complete the seal and then return to the central monolith to open the path. Oh, lordy. Won't you help? I thought you were going to assist on my quest. Uh, not this time there's a complication what sort of complication if what she told me is true only those like you can use the seal I would lose my mind by even trying how do I open the monolith okay let's do how, how can I find the the three stone K fingers did Usha mention how to locate the three monoliths Apparently, the fire worshippers know. I think they're at St. Michael's Church of the Burning Bush. Well, I guess I'll start there. And how do I open the monolith? How can I make the central monolith open? At least that part's easy. There's a place on it to put the seal. How can I find the three? Didn't I ask this question already? How can I find the three K fingers? Did Usha mentioned how to locate the three monoliths. Apparently. Well, I guess I'll. Okay. How can I stop the madness? What waits inside? How will I know what to do to stop this madness from spreading? It must be simple. She told me in her time they sent a man in who was able to fix it. If a mind savage succeeded, I'm sure you'll be fine. Did he return? I didn't ask. I just have to gather three parts for the seal, the three fingers. So, I just have to find three monoliths with K fingers to enter Katiganor. That could have been worse. Good luck, Reed. I'll continue to gather information and will certainly inform you of any important developments. In the same way, tormenting the dead. What else can be done if the living know nothing? Good luck with that. I don't need you anymore. Hmm. 
So we know how to get in now. We need to find the K fingers. And we need to find this to create the seal to open it up. So technically we don't need them anymore. What, but what does this statement mean? That we're going to get a chance to shoot them? Good luck with that. Okay, let's just let's go for it. I don't need you anymore. The job's done. You've served your purpose. Wait, you could still need me. And I'll just bring you back, like Usha. Oh, he managed to pull a shot off. Oh, <laughs> he took me for almost half my health. Now, bugger. Okay. So, let's go back and heal up. Reload. And there we are. I was hoping it would give me an opportunity. I don't know when. I didn't think it would actually um, put it into the dialogue. So as soon as I got out, what's prepared? I almost got killed. Good thing I I managed to get off the second shot, the defensive shot. Okay, so Joseph Hill is done. Usha's done. Now I can make my way up. Okay, I can't get, take any more. So let's take a look at real quick. The case file. We are now into the new case. We got it. We completed F fleeing Phoenix. All right. So now we've got a new case called Into the Depths. Now that I have everything I need, the seal and the knowledge of how to enter Katiganar, I fear that there may be no coming back from what comes next. So it's time to put all my affairs in order. When I'm ready. I'll return to my room in the Devil's Reef Hotel to rest and prepare for Katiganar. The ancient otherworldly artifact was found by Throgmorton's expedition to the depths beneath Oakmont. The seal was used in rituals by those who lived here in ancient times before the city was founded. It's complete. I am the seed. I can thus enter Katiganar. Okay, so I'm I'm literally on the the final path. Okay. Those structures right there, I believe are what I'm looking for. So, okay, let's just go straight down there. I'm, I am in the final run for end game. So we'll head to that, since we can see that there, let's head there first. And let's, or let's see if we can head there and let's see what it gives us. Or at least what we can accomplish from it. So we need to, I don't even know what's going to be in there. But I do need bullets. And there's my detour. Let's see if we can get inside. boxes okay this was like a quest location that is empty of boxes now and if you hear a lawnmower yes I'm recording on a Wednesday and there may be my 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 lawn folks outside cutting the lawn oh there it is okay this is blocked off for a region reason here. It's 
It's within that building. Oh, look, first aid. Okay. Oh, that creature that I killed is still. Oh no, that's something else. Oh, that's just gnarly looking. Okay. Yeah, I think there's some creatures over here. As soon as I come in, they may spawn. So I see my exit right there. I'm gonna run! Run! Oh my gosh, he came out. Man, I hate those creatures. So I gotta somehow... Where is that? Ah! Go away! That guy ran inside there. Come on out here, you little bugger. Oh, yes. I'll swing a shovel at you, man. So I took care of a bunch. Sorry folks, did not want to go all the way out here, but I had to. Woo! Is this where I need to go? get out. Um, people are freaking out because I'm running around with a gun shooting at some creature. Okay, it says here, now that I have everything I need, the, the seal, the knowledge of how to enter Katikinar, I fear that, that may have been coming back. Hmm. That's a question mark.
I mean, I assume that's where I needed to go. These big giant structures. But how do I even... Right? Nope. I guess it's not what it is I'm looking for. I'm wondering if I might be overthinking this. Okay, so I'm not, this is not helping me. The seal of Katiganar. Into the depths. Are they telling me I need to return to the Devil's Reef Hotel to rest and prepare for Katiganar? The final steps. Okay, I'm okay. All right, maybe I misread that. I'm assuming they want me to go back to the Devil's Reef Motel and sleep it off. So. I'm running around thinking I need to go to that structure and maybe it'll start that quest after I go to the motel. And where's the motel? Devil's Reef Motel? It's right here. up for grabs man oh uh oh Oh, what a horrible nightmare. <laughs> Poor old Charles. Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. Oh my gosh, what a... What a nightmare. Oh my gosh, his brain is fried. Holy cow. Charles, you are messed up, buddy. Okay, let's take a look and see what, what we got. We didn't get the daywear or the cultist yet. Maybe we'll get it soon. Is this new? The prophecy with my notes. Since dark eons before the age of man, Katiganor lies beneath the ground in the Eldritch prison. Rests in that Eldritch prison rests the dreamer's hidden daughter bound to never leave but there are those who would free the daughter if the dreamer's seed would only pass to her each turn of the cycle those carrying the seed are drawn to Katiganar driven by hideous vision the seal of Katiganar will open the way many will try and perish when the stars are right and the dreamer stirs in his house 
and one will succeed. The daughter will be freed, and from her swollen womb the dreamer sh shall spawn once more. Is this my fate? Will the one who succeeds die? Now they're talking all these little uh, hidden kind of language. I mean, the seed sounds like, you know, men, the sperm of man, and the the daughter is Katiganar or whatever this is, and then the daughter shall be freed when she has her womb is you know, will be, what it says here, carrying the seed will be drawn to Kitanar, driven by his vision, the seed of Kitanar will open the way, the dreamer starts in his house, one will succeed, the daughter shall be freed, and her swollen womb, the dreamer shall spawn once more, ugh, it's all weird, man, H.P. Lovecraft was, a, he was a, a mental, mental case, Putting everything together. The source of spreading madness is the dreamer is the dreamer's hidden daughter, locked in Katiganar, an eldritch prison beneath Oakmont. Only the seed can enter Katiganar and may open it or close it if for one more cycle. The entrance to Katiganar is the monolith in Central Advent. To open it I must complete the seal by finding three stone cave fingers growing on three monoliths around the city so i am right so the monoliths are the places where i need to go to find the k fingers and the one in the center is where i need to go to open it the first is on the central monolith to find the other two i'll need to seek out the fire worshipers Sorry about that. I got my wife came in. There's some children's stuff going on. I gotta make sure I have enough schedule for it. And there's this note here. Let's read it. Oakmont Chupacabra. Chupacabra. Gone? The Oakmont Chupacabra has ceased its attacks. This weird creature has spread terror throughout the city by leaving bloodless corpse in the streets. Thankfully, we have now had several nights with no signs of the blood-sucking monster. It's hard to know whether the residents of our city can once again feel at ease or whether the beast is just waiting for the right time to strike again. The Oakmont Chronicles is yet to conf <clears throat> the Oakmont Chronicle is yet to confidently conclude who or what this creature was. A wild beast, a wild animal, a vampire, or just a psychopathic and it should be psychopath, right? In any case, due caution is still advised. All right. So, we have rested, and we still have a little time to see where it <coughs> Excuse me. Let's head downstairs and see where this takes us. Dude, you have nobody here. I'm watching you. Newcomer. Whatever, dude. Okay. Hmm. Where were we before? We were near a train. Is it right here? So let's go here. Salvation Harbor North. Gotta find a K finger. Okay, so there's one over there. There's one right there. I don't even know if that's the center one. I'm looking towards it. So that's t somewhere over here. Who knows where, actually? I don't know. But let's deal with the one I know first, the one that was at before. Hopefully, we won't have any repop and have to kill those bloated creatures again going ahead of myself back 
to the guns. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, hold on. I'm, I'm not paying attention. There, see? There's a bunch of stuff here. City. Uh, just not re chupacabra. Oh, do I? Okay. So let's take a look at the what they what the case files dropped on us. Since Dark Eons, okay, we read that. And putting to get everything together. The source of the spreading madness is the dreamer's daughter. Okay, this is that weird whole weird thing. Central. The entrance to Katigana is the monolith in Central Advent. Okay, okay, let me let me, let me read it. The source of the spreading madness is the dreamer's hidden daughter, locked in Katigana, an eldritch prison beneath Oakmont. Only the seed, which is Charles Reed, can enter Katiganar and may open it or close it for one more cycle. The entrance to Katiganar is the monolith in Central Advent. Let's stop right there. Central Advent. So right here somewhere is that big giant stone statue next to that weird building. To open it, I must complete the seal by finding three stone K-fingers growing on three monoliths around the city. The first is on the, central mon is on the central monolith. To find the other two, I'll need to seek out the fire worshiper. The first is on the central monolith. Okay, see, I didn't read that. I am the seed. Katiganar holds a daughter. Katiganar holds the daughter. Nope. The prophecy... I might survive. The prophecy doesn't say that I'll die if I enter Katiganar. There's a chance I may survive. Okay. So I don't need to go here. I need to go to that center one in Advent. So I don't need to go here. I need to go to the one in the center of Advent. That's where I'll find the first key. Then I'll probably go to these the surrounding ones. Like the one over there and the one right there. So let's go to the one in Central Advent. I got about 10 minutes. I just burn time because I'm not reading. Okay, let's go here. Okay. Holy cow. Okay, I have about 10 minutes left. I don't know. Oh, it's a church. I gotta enter a church and fight. Oh, no. Oh, and all the torches are lit now. Oh, no. That means there's gonna be some fighting. That's gonna mean some talking. And that means... There's going to be some... Stuff that I have to do. But I am going to leave that, ladies and gentlemen, everybody, for the next episode. I appreciate it, all of you for joining me today on this episode of um, The Sinking City. We are approaching the end of... The series, I think. We might be actually nearing the end of the series. And that means getting the K fingers and then entering Katiganar and possibly deciding whether to unleash the fury of Cthulhu and all the crazy nut jobs or stopping it for another season. But anyhow, if you like my kind of goofy content, my spastic gameplay, Make sure you click on subscribe and then click on that bell to get notified when I upload new content. And hopefully you'll keep up with the series with me. And that will be on the next episode. And again, I appreciate you joining me. 
And hopefully on the next episode, we'll move a little closer to end game. Until then, have a good one. Extra, extra.